Hi, Sharon Crean here from Beyond Water. I'm very excited about 2024. Yesterday we had our first girl project in the Kibera slum in Nairobi. We had about 60 girls there. We had Mary Minari, who is a mental health specialist, come and talk to our, our students as they start the school year. But I had some challenges already presented to me. And it's small ones for us here in the West, where I currently am. We're about to start our 2024 Pedal Against Poverty New Zealand tour. But listen to this. One girl did a great uh, primary school result and your primary school result determines what type of high school you go to. And, but she couldn't afford to go because she didn't have the $10 for an admin fee to get into school. So we fixed that one. But then we have Gloria, who scored an amazing result in her final exams. Her parents managed to scrape together everything uh, for her school fees, but they didn't have the money for setup costs, which is your school uniform. Also, uh, she's going to boarding school, so she'll need things like a bucket, towel. Um, she'll have to have a container to put things in. We call it a locket, it's a metal container. L lots of bits and pieces like that. Things aren't expensive, but they add up. A school blazer is a mere $20. So what we're looking for is people to donate towards our uh, education fund that we use for emergency placements like this. For families who they would love to have their kids in school but can't afford it. Now, this is tax deductible in New Zealand, Australia and the US. If you can't afford the $200 to go towards Gloria's uh, full fees that she needs, just even $10 or $20 or even $5 will add that up, get her into school. It's much better to have students in school than at home and roaming around, perhaps getting pregnant, doing menial tasks like collecting water or washing clothes and things like that. You've got to keep these kids in school. It's a much better result uh, for a small amount of money. Hear from Gloria and then I'll have a link there where you can make that donation. Thanks. Hi, my name is Gloria Patient. I'm 14 years. I finished class 8 last year, 2023. I had 304 marks. I, my parents have, have been able to help me find the school fees of the school. I was, I was asking if you could assist me to get the requirements for the school so that I can go to school on Monday or next week if it's possible. And if you do that to me, I'll be very grateful to you guys. So I say thank you for hearing me out. Thank you for being with us since the year started until now. So I'm here and I'm saying thank you to you. And I, when you help me, I promise that I will work hard in school. And when I grow up, I want to be a lawyer to fulfill my potential. Thank you.